Davis, California, and I'm a Qi Nate Sung practitioner, also Universal Healing Tao instructor. And then in terms of uh, my experience in the Tao, I have to say that if I was to surmise one word to describe what it is that I learned from all the teachings of Tao is self-empowerment. I feel like it has improved the quality of life condition. It has elevated my uh, sense of vitality and uh, realization of longevity into my everyday life. It's very practical and I'm so happy that uh, I have been gifted with the knowledge of Tao and, and everything that uh, Master Mantak Chia has been teaching here. Already in the gardens, there's a buzz. Everybody's so excited about attending this. The whole thing is that um, in the India, they have Kama Sutra. In the Tao practice, we have the, we call the sex manual from the Yarrow Emperor, which go back to 4,700 years old. So these two of the oldest sex manual that's still passing down. And they still have people uh, doing it and practicing it. Definitely, it goes to a lot of difficulty. So this is the two oldest sex manual. Now in the Tao practice, they have many, uh, we call the make love technique. And I'm very emphasized in their energetic, uh, physical, how the physical beneficial, and how the uh, soul sex and the spiritual sex are more working in it. And um, in the Indian part, they're very, also this very similar, but approached in a different angle. And in the, um, in the, um, in the Hindu, uh, in the Indian part, the tantric area is very highly specialized in how to have the highly arousal, orgasm, love, compassion, and how to combine all this energy. So I can see these two come from a very old tradition way, come up together, and in a different, the same subject, but come up from a different angle. And there's alchemy on both levels. Right. Alchemy from that practice and alchemy in here. Mm -hmm. So it's like, it's, it's a wonderful, I feel like it's a wonderful marriage of the two modalities to really bring somebody into that refinement of, you know, from being basic and then really refining oneself into being polished. Yes. So uh, I think that is mm -hmm. the, like in the Tao ways, we, we keep a very clear cut how to transform the sexual energy and how to multiply and the, the why and the reason why behind it. To do it very clear cut. Let's go first into into some some information uh, on the chi. Like, how do you view it? Chi is our life force. Yeah. It's our our vital force that we are all, you know, born with. And a lot of the work that I've studied with Master Mantak Chia evolves around how to cultivate your chi, how to bring that so that you are generating energy instead of depleting your energy. Yeah. Um, you know, Tantra, you, you. Tantra was also a, another practical means for me. I felt like well, having studied Tantra with various Tantra practitioners and educators, um, to me what I got from that is that Tantra brings the element of spiritual openness, you know, opening up your mind yeah. and liberating yourself. And I really like that concept. And to tuning into people and being really connected, being soulfully connected. That's how I feel Tantra has worked for me in my practice with clients, uh, my relations with people. Tantra has served me in that manner. Yeah, and then chi flows between the, the two? Is that what happens? Chi, uh, chi is a way to, um, to strengthen myself as a practitioner. Okay. So that's... So when I, when I study Taoism and Qigong, I become strong as a practitioner and as a person. I have a personal power that I create and I build so that I can be, so that I can be of service. Yeah. I want to talk mm -hmm. about for a second about this, this uh, beautiful retreat coming up with Mantak Chia and, uh, and Charles Mera, right? Mira, and yeah. You, 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 you love both of them, so you must be pretty excited to, to bring them together in January of next year, January 2016. Can yes. you tell us what the purpose is? Because this is quite special here, bringing the Tao 
and the Tantra together. These are two different kind of schools. No? How, do, how would you combine both of them you know, to start with? Charles Muir and Master Mantakchia, when they combine their uh, knowledge of sexual healing, is what they call it, and sexual healing is more in in the realm of how to how to tap into our sexual energies through our reproductive organs, how do we cultivate our energy within ourselves, how do we heal whatever blockages that might be there on our base chakras and and on up, you know, and and the two of them with the mindset of healing brings the concept of, of these two philosophies together and teaches an, an amazing uh, retreat where it's healers from all over the world and you get to exchange energies with healers and you get to practice. Mm -hmm.